Every state in America and every province in Canada has their own tourism budget. Uh, the second reason that we like this idea is that locals are the primary tourists in every market that, they, that there is tourism. And I pulled this statistic off the internet because I'd heard it before and I thought it was very interesting. In the state of California, uh, they measure their tourists by domestic tourists, those coming from the United States, and international tourists, those coming from anywhere but the United States. For domestic tourism in the state of California, 84% of all of our domestic tourists come from California from within the state. So only 16%, the other 49 states represent 16% of the tourism in the state of California. So it's a huge number. Locals represent a huge number of tourists. So if you're in Northern California, a huge amount of this tourism comes from local tourists. One of our largest tourist attractions here is Pier 39 in the Bay Area. And Pier 39 has their own campaign called Locals Know, and they send out emails to locals all the time to get locals to come out to Pier 39. So it's a really important reason to pick this idea. Next reason this idea was chosen is a fully integrated campaign. They used every element they have with the CBC. And the, the other reason this idea was chosen is this is a perfect idea for recovering the economy. People are starting to spend money again. Uh, people have been saving. They haven't been traveling. People are starting to travel again. It's a perfect time for everyone to be hitting up their tourism councils, their local tourism, their, their, their chambers of commerce, things like that. Uh, and go after that tourism dollar. So those are the reasons that idea was picked. Let's talk about some of the program details. First of all, the goal of the program was to stimulate local travel. In other words, Canadians traveling within Canada. Second reason was to create opportunities for small and medium businesses who benefit from that travel. And then the third and probably the most important reason behind this campaign was to build a tourism database, a database that Canadian Tourism Council could, Commission could go back to and remarket back to this database again and again. Uh, the CBC created what they call the Best of Canada Contest. And the Best of Canada Contest was simply this. They had viewers, they had Canadians send in their best local tourism ideas. And then those ideas got turned into on-air stories and, and promotions and ideas. Um, they had in-depth mentions in a program called The Hour. And it's hosted by a, a gentleman named George Strom Stromobopoulos. George, I'm sure I hosed your last name. But anyway, Strombo is his nickname. And, uh, and he's a terrific personality, well-known throughout all of Canada. And, and he really was a huge supporter of the campaign. And a lot of interstitials, we're going to see some of that, uh, were done in his show. The campaign ran from May 3rd to June 13th of this year. And the client loved the campaign so much, they wrote a testimonial for the CBC. This is a letter that came from the Canadian Tourism uh, Commission to the CBC, thanking them for their hard work. And the important thing is here at the bottom of the letter. It says, the Best of Canada contest delivered in every respect. Now, this is a public, this is a government organization, right? The Best of Canada contest delivered in every respect. It generated consumer leads to our campaign websites, provided the CTC with a database of interested customers subscribing to further information on Canadian tourism, and finally delivered a repository of potential tourism experiences as a legacy piece for future use. In addition to the above, the creative workflow process with the hour contest team was both professional and pleasurable. We commend the CBC team and their diligence to execute the Best of Canada contest, and we look forward with working, to working with them in the future. So we're going to roll a video. George's going to roll the video here. This runs about 2 minutes and 55 seconds, and it gives you an overview of the program. Getting Canadians excited about their own travel experiences and then sharing them with others is a journey worth all the planning it takes. That's what the Canadian Tourism Commission discovered when it teamed up with CBC and The Hour to deliver an integrated initiative that achieved every objective. For the CTC, that objective was multifaceted. To encourage Canadians to travel within Canada, stimulate small and medium companies, and build a database of both names and travel experiences for future use. In support of the CTC's Locals Know domestic marketing campaign, CBC and The Hour developed the Best of Canada contest, which fully embraced the CTC's existing campaign concept and was intended to extend its reach. The contest asked Canadians to identify their own favorite Canadian experiences and to plot them on a map to share them with others. The locations uploaded to the contest brought to light many restaurants, museums, and adventure outings worthy of further discovery that the CTC can continue to profile in future marketing activities. One of the most historic lighthouses in British Columbia, and the hour continues on the road. All right. The CBC team, along with George Strombolopoulos, host of The Hour, played a key role in the integration and success of the entire initiative. 
cbc.ca slash CR. Go on there and check out the best of Canada. Uh, just, you know, find out places you love to go in this country so you can share it with other people. There were in-depth, in-show mentions of a contest, nine to be exact, over the six-week run. You got a place in this country that, you know, if you're in the city, you have to eat there. The famous. Uh, 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 oh, what, Gerard. What do you order when you go there? We just say, Suki, are, can you cook for us tonight? Strong promotional support augmented the activation, including on-air contest spots, weekly topic-specific billboards, online co-promotional brand sell, and a constant push from the Hour's digital team. CBC's The Hour and Localsnow.ca want your help to find the best of Canada. Go online and tell us about your Canadian favorite, and you could win a trip or two anywhere in the country. Travel voucher included. Show us your best of Canada today. The Best of Canada interactive map was developed exclusively for Localsnow.ca. The map itself, the information shared, and the cross-promotion with the existing Localsnow.ca map were all a part in the success and innovation of the campaign. The Best of Canada contest became the most successful sponsor-driven contest ever executed on the hour. The contest partnership was successful on many levels. It brought profile to small and medium businesses around the country. It successfully allowed the CTC to reach a broader audience with the locals' no messaging. The Best of Canada initiative delivered in every respect. Fantastic! It generated consumer leads to CTC campaign websites, provided CTC with a new database of interested customers, and finally delivered a wealth of potential tourism experiences for future use. This integrated promotion was a destination that both CBC and the Canadian Tourism Commission were happy to experience.